Um, oh, do, do, does blender? everyone know who the streamer is? Doctor Disrespect. Does everyone know this guy? Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, no. This is the guy that puts he he puts on a wig and he puts on red glasses and he puts on a fake mustache. The whole thing is fake. And uh, he was he was accused of talking to minors on Twitch and he got banned for a while mm. or whatever. Right. Yeah, but he recently came back and he's still number two on YouTube, which is crazy because he tweeted today, uh, I won't be updating my iPhone to iOS 18. For me, 17 feels just right. Hmm. Uh, <laughs> <Whoa>. <laughs> uh, I don't know how I feel about that, guys. Uh, love Twitter. Love X. Love the triple X. Uh, I can't wait until Elon just pulls the plug and literally calls it triple X because it's already banned in five countries. He might as well just get it over with. Um, Jesus Christ. Did you know you can go to jail for 20 years in Brazil for going on X? Did you know that? That's worse than porn, Tommy. That's worse than porn. That's crazy. (laughs) Yes, absolutely. Um, My name is Kyle. And some people, when they meet me, they think that I'm Jewish. Uh, but in reality, I would make the absolute worst Jew because my name is just one letter away from being a Ka. Never mind. <laughs> I wouldn't make a good Jew. Uh, I'm also poor. So there's that. Um, I'm convinced now, now that AI is like huge, right? I'm convinced that my dreams are fed to me by artificial intelligence because even in my dreams, I can't read any of the text that these images make. Help me. Uh, Just in case you guys need another reason for not waking up in the morning, they have announced that the new James Bond movie is coming out and James Bond is now a woman. (gasps) fuck off (laughs) yes it's true when i was growing up james bond got the most pussy in hollywood in 2024 he got an operation to buy a pussy it's weird (laughs) (laughs) that's not i have a girlfriend (laughs) shut up <laughs> J- Jimmy Bond. <laughs> Jamie. Jamie Bond, ladies and gentlemen. Jamie, Jamie Bonds. Okay. Jamie Bonds. The only one that can play Bond is Tilda Swift. That's all I'm going to say. I don't believe that shit. Taylor <laughs> Swift would make a terrible <laughs> Jamie Bond, Wicked Kitten. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> I knew that would get her going. <laughs> Oh, man. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to MediConnect next week with my girlfriend. Give it up to my girlfriend. Make some noise for her. Woo! Woo! Okay. Casey! Okay. Woo! Woo! For you. I feel bad for you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, she has autism. Round of applause for that. <laughs> Every time she wakes up in the morning, I look at her in the eyeballs, and all I can see there is a reflection of a Windows 95 boot up screen. <laughs> <laughs> and then I start to see flying toasters, and I'm like, "Whoa, she's rebooting!" <laughs> Starfield coming at you. Um, my girlfriend was giving me a metaverse lecture the other day, and uh, my computer decided to disconnect the mouse in the middle of it and made the disconnect noise from the USB. Doo-doo-doo. And then my girlfriend just stopped moving and didn't say anything. And I just looked at her and I was like, holy shit, she's in VR so much, I guess she couldn't tell if it was a computer or a brain. It's wild. (laughs) Uh, Recently, I told my daughter a story, right? Me growing up, my best friend's name was Josh. He ended up being a cuck. And uh, yeah, and we weren't friends. A cuck. (laughs) C-U-C-K. No, 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 not a chef. A cock. Okay. Yeah. You know the little chair in hotel rooms on the side? <laughs> you know those? <laughs> I, I don't, actually. I don't. Okay. I never don't. been in a hotel in your life. Got it. Not Approved. a cheap one, no. Um, okay. All right. Well, growing up, my best friend's name was Josh, and uh, we were just playing some Smash Brothers, and his mom came in, gave us dinner, and then on the way out, she said, if you need anything, let me know, and then she farted and closed the door. <laughs> And I was like, what the fuck? Right? And she came back in. I'm like, can I ask why you farted and closed the door? And she says, it's a very sensitive subject, Kyle, but I'll tell you anyway. My sister actually died from not farting for a month. And I was like, whoa. Whoa. 
that's crazy, you know? And she says, we are a fart friendly house. So I'm like, okay. So, you know, I let one rip. Um, but then I told this story to my daughter and my, fr the first thing my daughter says, she says, wow, talk about girls don't fart taken to the next level. Huh, dad? I'm like, yes, absolutely. <laughs> Tommy, I got a joke for you that I wrote for my daughter. Yeah. Please stop dancing as a baby in front of the mirror. I'm just see what I'm fucking I creep. Oh god. Have a seat. <laughs> oh. Have a seat right over there. Uh, <laughs> why did the comedian cross the road? Why? 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 To get some fresh air because for the 10th Monday in a row, my dad's been downtown waiting next to the dumpsters with the rest of the trash behind Joe Rogan's comedy club getting on a fucking oh. special needs podcast. <laughs> Thank God he hasn't tried to take me to kill Tony because if he did, my mom probably filed for full custody. <laughs> What's going on here? What? Is this, just is this an inside? Oh, no, God. it's oh. just it, it's, what? Never mind. You don't get out. You don't get out much. We love you. I don't get Give it up to Wicked I Kitten, ladies it. and gentlemen. Thank you. That's I okay. Didn't get it. You don't need to get it. You don't need to get it. I really want uh, to get it. I need to understand. No, it's okay. We're we're past okay. it now. All right. Yeah. All right. Uh, so I did the Joe Exotic interview, and part one is out on the internet. I love the internet because the Joe Exotic interview got two thousand views on Twitter. And then there was a picture of 18 titties, Lily herself, Lily herself, and I posted double five G's, and it got 90,000 views. That's all, okay? I love the internet. I do all this fucking work, Priorities. and then all I have to do is put double five G's, and I go through the roof and get 100 followers overnight, guys. It's fucking stupid. <laughs> I've been going to the gym again, which is great, but last night when I was sleeping, I got a Charlie horse. Anyone got one of those? Puzzler? Yep. Yeah. Eat more bananas. Eat more bananas. Yeah, but I got a Charlie horse. Do you know why they call it a Charlie horse? Does anyone actually know? No. No, no let me tell you the history about it. Who gives a fuck? They fucking hurt! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, tonight your headliner that wasn't supposed to be the headliner, and I promise that he cannot do 30 minutes, is Mike Kudak, and he's drunk as usual. <laughs> <laughs> Make some noise for that. Hooray. Yeah. Yeah. Right after right after your first comic, we got Chris Tinkle coming in hot and he's gonna be late. Give it up to Chris Tinkle for being late. I'm sure his girlfriend is too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then right now, ladies and gentlemen, this is the first time I've seen him in VR chat in fucking forever. Give it up to the Monday night king. It's Tommy Simbazo. Woo! Yay! Hey Tommy! Check. Hey guys, check this out. Yeah! <laughs> what? <laughs> what? That's, what? That's that? all. That's all I was doing. So guys, uh, uh, where are my autistics at? Make some social situation <laughs> awkward. Ah. <laughs> 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 uh, I work at I work at Baltimore Gas and Electric, which is like a huge fucking company, and all their technology is stuck in the fucking nineties. And but it it is the most diverse workplace that I've ever fucking worked at, right? And there are language breakdowns between uh, uh, things we say here and like in English and these other you know other things. And there is this large redheaded man from uh from uh Argentina uh. <laughs> <laughs> named Danello. And Danello, one of my buddies, works there. My, I have a buddy that has worked there, and I've known Jose since, like, we were teenagers, right? So uh, Danello was like, and you'll know, uh, you'll know Jose? And I was like, yeah, Danello. I, uh, Jose and I are, were very good friends. He was uh, my first roommate. Uh, we dated twins. He married his. I dumped mine. Uh, basics very, very awkward. Uh, not only did I dump my twin, but I found my wife the very next day. So, so, uh, which means she was trash, and I won. Uh, but, but so Danella was like, you have, uh, you have slept with Jose? And I was like, yeah. Of course, yeah, I've slept with Jose. Like, and in my head, I'm like, I've slept on his bedroom floor. We've shared a tent. 
But then Danello apparently has been going around the office telling people that I slept with Jose. That Jose and I have <laughs> fucked and we're a couple. And, <laughs> which there was a uh, an Iranian fellow, uh, Abrahim. He uh, totally misconstrued it, and he and he comes and so today I heard that he like freaked out because he heard that I had fucked Jose. So uh, he, he he came over to near my cubicle. Well, I don't have a cubicle yet because this company is so big that they don't have seats for everybody. Uh, the place that is supplying the electricity for 90% of Maryland, uh, there's no seats for anybody to work, uh, sit on. So I sit at a table uh, next to the copy machine right now. Uh, I feel like a Rob Snyder SNL character because now people come by and I'm like, here's Danello, the Dan Man, the da, da, da Gogurt. I don't know. Why the, how the fuck you make fun of a stupid name like Danello? Uh, <laughs> but so he comes over to get uh, Abraham comes over to get his copies and out of nowhere I was like I didn't fuck Jose and he was like uh, this is my first interaction with this person too I was like I didn't fuck Jose and he was like what 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 and I was like yeah Jose he was my roommate when Danilo told you we slept together I, I didn't fuck him uh, not that there was anything wrong with fucking Jose but I, I didn't I didn't fuck Jose I fucked his wife's sister. Uh, <laughs> totally different and then he was like well if I were you I wouldn't and Danello sits across from me and he was like if I were you I wouldn't be so close to Danello he's a bad influence I was like maybe I need a bad influence and then Danello was like you, you see you see that is how a true friend is that is a true friend response I was like yes Danello and I are very good friends I plan on sleeping with him as well <laughs> Uh, <laughs> to which I then heard every coworker within a five desk radius go, Jesus Christ. And I was like, yeah, I probably said that louder than I should have. <laughs> so I'm looking forward to HR. Wow, those guys, were you guys just making out? Is that a make out thing? Okay. All right. Hey, you know, whatever. Hey, I've seen. The, okay. I've been. I've done a comedy show before where uh, the people in the front row. The guy was fingering the lady right in front of, at McGooby's. Well, that's the guy. There was a, a couple sitting in the front row, and he's like just finger banging her, and like uh, you know, I'm trying to do my sets, <laughs> and I'm like. Uh, and I was like, hey, everybody, if you, if you like having sex, smell your finger. And just a trickle. <laughs> trickle and be like, oh, he got me. He got me. And I was like, wrong home, motherfucker. <laughs> I didn't tell you what hole he was fingering. I just said he was finger. He was finger banging. Yeah. He was, he was booty popping. Just boop, 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 right in the. Uh... Oh, my goodness. There you go. This is probably wrong for a baby to do this. I... <laughs> it's fine. I'm a Resident Evil baby. Goo goo gaga. I fucked Jose. Oh, uh... oh my God. <laughs> so uh, I told you. I told you guys on Monday. Uh, for some of those you don't know, my mom is. Yeah, she has something up with her butthole muscles, and like they cut them, <laughs> or they're weak. I don't know. She has like palsy of the butthole muscles, uh, butt palsy, and she went. She's going for an experimental procedure so that they can put a battery pack in her, and then wires wire up her butthole muscles so that she will have a cybernetic butthole. Uh, which is yeah. She every six months she has to sit on like an iPhone charger to fucking get it to charge. <laughs> I can't wait to like Bluetooth connect to my mom's butthole and just. Uh, <laughs> or if she has to shit real bad and she has to solve a captcha, she's like, oh, which of these pictures have pandas? And she's trying to. Ah, fuck! I got a blue! I gotta prove I'm not a robot so I can shit out of my metal asshole. <laughs> uh, speaking of shitting in weird places, uh, on my birthday, my insurance company <laughs> sent me a Cologuard test. 
Do you know what a cola guard test is? Yeah. It's a test that you, it's a non-invasive test to test for colon cancer. Uh, the way you do this is they send you a box, you shit in the box, and then, and then you send it to them. Like it, in any other country, this is like a prank. This is like, ah, I, got, I got you. I got you, Jose's wife's sister. I send you a shit in the box. It's a shit in a box. Uh, but, and then I'm not, I hate going to the fucking bank. I hate going to the post office. So I'll probably shit in this box. And it's going to sit on my kitchen table for a couple of days <laughs> until I can't stand the smell anymore. Uh, and then like my fiance, Lou, she was like, uh, <laughs> She was like, you don't shit in the box. I was like, you 100% shit into this box. And she was like, there's no way that's true. And I open it, and there's like a bag in there, right, mm -hmm. uh, with some sort of like plastic opening that you shit in. And she was like – and it says right there, do not remove bag from box. So you have to shit into this box like oh you're a disgruntled God. elf at the North Pole. You have to shit in this box and then wrap it up. What if I lose the box? Can I just send them some diarrhea in a manila envelope? Will that work? Is that good? If I'm just like per.